Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Y'all, it's me, Steph. And if you see my hair in these clips, you either know that I'm going to do a deep conditioner or some type of wash and go style, whatever it may be. But I still haven't shampooed my hair yet, but I'm gonna do a little quick intro before I get ready to shampoo. But this will be a review for a main choice product. And I have their exotic cool laid mask and it is their refreshing cool scalp and nourish laid hair fresh mango and passion fruit mask it's supposed to be infused with biotin and vitamin d and e so i'm really looking forward to using this mask i haven't used a main choice mask um since their ancient egyptian mask which i did like that one i do not have a review for it and also the mask in their original line um that comes in the tube and it might not be it, i think it's now their alpha line but i really did not like that one um so yes hopefully i will like this one but let me tell you some of the claims or the directions on what to do first shampoo your hair which i'm going to do distribute evenly throughout towel dried hair especially on the ends leaving the hair for 15 to 20 minutes with heat and up to one hour without heat so it's either giving you those options, 15 to 20 with the heat, or if you don't want to use heat, leave it in for one hour. I might just leave it in one hour without using any heat. Rinse well with the cool water. So now really on to the claims. The mango, y'all, it's, it's hard for me to read this. It's a very small font. And then the reflection from the light out here, it's really bright outside because of all the snow. So it's just hard for me to read. Mango helps reinforce integrity of hair from roots to ends. The passion fruit intensely repairs and restores compromised hair. <laughs> Mineral rich formula drastically softens and conditions, helps to promote a natural healthy shine, improves elasticity and overall vitality, and is gentle enough for daily use. I ain't gotta worry about that claim. I'm not gonna be using this on the daily, but I am looking forward to applying it right after I shampoo my hair. I'll be back. So I have finished shampooing my hair. Um, my hair is not soaking wet currently, but I'm not about to use this rough towel to towel dry it like the directions suggested. So I'm gonna X that out and not even do that. Um, hmm. Upon first scent or sniff, the smell is literally just okay i was expecting more i mean it's faintly smelling fruit fruit like but it's not super super fruity i will say the consistency y'all it feels very thick um feels very very thick but it is going through my hair nicely Kind of didn't even show y'all the thickness of it. I'm gonna put a little bit more in my hair or on this section in particular. But it's like very, it's super, super thick. Um, extremely thick. Kind of reminds me of maybe like a styling cream consistency. You try to separate this section up just a little bit, kind of put this midway through just to make sure all of my strands have product. I do feel a little bit of slip, not a ton, um, but I've never read anything about slip and I like slippery deep conditioners. So hopefully after I leave it in my hair a little while, um it will have a little bit more detangling properties than it does right now so i'm gonna go ahead and twist this up while i do that on camera while i'm still continue to talk y'all see it's not like slipping and sliding like i looked for it to be but i'm gonna go ahead apply this to the other three sections of my hair and then we are not going to use heat i'm just going to leave it on for one hour. I'm gonna go ahead and put like a curly grocery bag on it. Y'all know how I roll with a bonnet on top of that. And then we'll see how, how it feels after 
I rinse it out. Deep conditioner has been on my hair for exactly an hour. I had this bonnet on top of this Kroger bag, trying to collect some of the warmth and heat from my body temperature. And let's see how it feels. I will say this, um, it just feels like it's soaked into my hair. I like how it feels y'all at first I was kind of not feeling this mask but feeling the hair now it feels really good it feels really good okay let me try to lightly detangle with this wire to comb I'm gonna split the section up before I move on up. And it's doing a good job of getting through that section of my hair. So I will say, make sure you leave this mask on for the recommended amount of time if you want to get the full benefits. It is helping to tangle my hair. Y'all remember when I was talking about, oh, it doesn't have much slip, which it didn't upon first application. Feels much better now, but it never advertised. Oh, oh let me get that tangle out. <laughs> it never advertised that it was going to have slip. So I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this out my hair and then I will be right Back. Just finished rinsing out my hair with this Main Choice hair mask. And while rinsing it out, my hair felt incredibly soft. I could tell um, that this mask did do a great job on my hair. Oh, y'all, my hair feels really good. There is a nice shine on my hair. Hair feels very soft. I went ahead and I detangled with the shower to comb all four sections of my hair before I went ahead and rinsed out the conditioner. And I am very pleased on how my hair looks. It looks really good, y'all. Looks really good. It feels good. There is a shine to it. It was easy to detangle. Yes, it does. Hair feels conditioned like I had just used a really quality mask. I was not feeling this upon first applying it to my hair. Just being honest, the directions for this mask, go ahead and either use heat or just keep it on your hair for an hour like um, it directs you to do. Some of the key ingredients, of course we know water, they've got coconut oil, shea butter, and that's probably where it's getting that, that thickness, creamy like consistency. Uh, I'm gonna skip on down to okay the next ingredient i'm not skipping glycerol saturate glycerin glycerol dilerate btms sterile alcohol aloe leaf juice vitamin c biotin y'all and it's a ton of other oils and quality ingredients it does have some dyes listed at the end and the very last ingredients is fake is fragrance which is perfume and essential oil blaze based but I can tell you right now, my fragrance for this is extremely, extremely light, which is surprising to me because I know how um, Main Choice's products, they can be heavily fragranced. Okay, to sum it up in a nutshell, am I glad I purchased this deep conditioner? Absolutely. This did a wonderful job on my hair. I would highly recommend it. Line has been out for a while, so I am very late to the game on trying this and purchasing this. But, you know, I got this during their Black Friday sale, which was, I think I paid 60% off for this. 60, something like that. Their sale was absolutely wonderful. And then I had free shipping. Um, so yeah, this two thumbs up. Step up. All right, guys, I want to thank y'all so much for watching my video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.